every program needs objects. To create an object, tap on the plus symbol on the bottom left in the main view. Here we have four possibilities. We can draw an object by ourselves. We can load an object from the media library. We can select a picture from our gallery. Or we can take a picture with the phone's camera and use this picture as our object. Let's tap on media library. In the media library, you find lots of different objects. Since we're creating a zoo, we are looking for an animal. A cute panda bear would be nice. To select it, tap on the object. Now you need to give your object an appropriate name. If you tap on OK, the object will be added to your program. It appeared in the main view. Now it would be nice to give our animal a certain behavior. This is where the programming starts. Tap on the object to get to the object view. Every object has scripts, sounds and looks. Tap on scripts to get to the scripts view. Here we can program our object by adding different bricks. Tap on the plus symbol to see the different brick categories. Each category contains bricks with a similar purpose. We start in a category event. In this category, Pick the brick when program starts. Tab on a brick and place it in the script view. To add another brick, tap on the plus symbol again. This time we go to the control category and look for the brick. Wait one second. Tap on this brick and place it underneath when program starts. For the next brick, look for the change size by brick. You find this brick in the category looks. Some bricks have numbers or text which is thin and underlined. This means that you can change these numbers. Tap on the number to open the formal editor. In the editor, change the number to the value 50. Tap on OK to save this new value. Try to find and to place these bricks by yourself. If you're done, we should think about the behavior of the object. When the program starts, the object waits a second, then it should get bigger by 50 pixels. Then it waits another second before it gets smaller again. It is important to notice that the bricks are processed from top to down. Let's check if that's really the case by tapping on the play button. Oh yeah, as you see it works. To get back, tap on the back button to see the control panel and there tap on back to get to the scripts view. If you tap back again, you get to the object view. We now programmed our first animal. Of course, we can add many more bricks to our object, or we can also create more objects and program them. We will learn this in the next video.